on the YouTube. Let's hope so, that we're live. There we go. Just turn the, hope you can all hear me fine. If you are watching, just leave a note in the chat if you are. Something a bit different this week. Um, if I just move them across, hopefully you can all see that. Uh, <clears throat> I hope everyone's well in the hood, as I said, <laughs> in the hood, I should say. Doo mm. doo. Right. So, have we got any people watching just yet? So we look. Oh, we got seven in the chat, which is good. So if you are there. Let me know, which would be good. Um, yeah, so. Uh, hi, George. Hope you're well. Hi, Dan. Hi, George again. Seeing the USAF B1 Lancers have arrived at RAF Efford. Fair play. Hi, hi, Black Dice Gaming. And uh, hi, Island RC Duke. I'll talk to you during for the chat. If you want to have a, ask me any questions, you can. We're going to be building this thing tonight, which is the Wooden City Limited Edition Bolid. If you've not seen the video, if you look in the description, it should tell you there um, the information about this kit. So we're going to have a little go and build this. They've sent me four of these kind of kits to build. Um, yeah, I've got the, the sports car, the cruiser, the buggy and the bolid. They also sent me the hot rod, which is this one here which was already pre-built, so I can see. Hiya, Plastic Alchemist, hope you're well. And so we're going to have a little look and build this kit. Now, these are held on with magnets. It's quite a nice little box, that. And you can use it as a display. Okay, so we've got the instructions there. We also have inside the box one, two, three. Come on, out you come and four like wooden kind of sprues they're um laser cut plywood and they're quite nice so the detail on them is great as i said if you want to quickly nip over and see that video that i've done in there also this so if you want to see that video it is in the description down below with the unboxing but we're going to build this one tonight these are the feet for this box and hopefully you won't need it if you hear any noise um it's the tractors going behind it's a bit loud tonight for some reason so instructions there's 105 parts on four sheets um four spare parts they give you four spare in case some break and three of a bat you will need a razor blade scissors sandpaper and wax candle very carefully push out the pieces from the front side of the board taking care not to break them if the piece does not come out gently Cut the notches with a razor blade. This model does not require glue or paint. To reduce friction, the gear face and the axle rotation area should be waxed. Assemble in a well-lit area and follow the instructions carefully. You can also disassemble this model in reverse order. So, which is good. Some little, little notches there. The first thing we're going to need is this uh, little tool here. So hopefully we can just push that little tool out. Very nice. There's a motorbike going by. Sorry about the noise. And uh, so, yeah, there's the little tool that we need. So, uh, the, um, there's a large rubber band piece, which is here. We'll just open the box up. Uh, the box, open up the bag up carefully. So, there's the little bit of wax that we need. We have, uh, there's a uh, one there, two there three four and five it's five six elastic bands that we need the small rubber piece fits in there it looks like um ah the yellow rubber band is for the rotation of the model mechanism install it as shown in the picture okay and uh this one's here this t 
and so we basically start them and here we go they're in steps so saying here you need number one and number two and then the three so we go through the sprues and find so there's number one carefully push him out there he goes so there's number one number one there he should look like that and then number two is there then you have these little blocks here three blocks Should be able to push out using the tool. Cool. He's tight in there. There's one. And there's two. There's number three. I'm assuming you take out the next one as well. Because you need three of them. Okay, so let's uh, get him on camera to push him out. So you need that one there. He's a bit tight. Cool. There you go. So there's the three you need. What I am going to do is I've got some. What have I done with them here? Some little flexi file here, little cut and trims. And what I'll use is the orange grit, which is 280, to um, just give them a little sand down, I think. So that's the 280 there. Just to give them a little sand down so we can get out all the notches. Just trim him up, give him a bit of a clean. Hi, Mark. Nice to see you. Yeah, it's going to be a little interesting little build. I'm quite looking forward to it. So, in theory, then, these go in here. So, you've got... I'm just going to get a bit of a clean up. A bit of a notch on there. There you go. So, in theory, then, you've got... Looks like they go in the top. So you've got the the one. What they go they're going flush, do they? I'm assuming they're going flush. There you go. It's in flush. And that one there is a little bit of a cleanup. There we go. Nicely cleaned up and put him in there. I hope I've got them the right way. I don't think it matters at the moment which way they go in. And there we go. Let's make sure they're in. That's in flat. And then, so this here, if I'm looking at it right, it goes in there. Right. Always pushed him out, pushed him through. Where's the first one in? Little bit on the tight side. It's where you get your little tool and then push him in and push that back in through. That's him, push him back in through. Cool. He's solid. There you go. So that looks like that. Just trying to see the picture there. Um, I 
Hmm, I don't know what that picture is actually saying there. Check orientation of each piece before connecting. I think I've done it right there. So there's the... Hmm. So that, I think that looks all right to me. Anyway, we digress. So then we've got to get piece number four out now. Give a bit of a push. These do actually come out quite easily. To be really fair. Hi, Sprue and Glue, hope you're well. And then what you need to do is put a little piece of wax here around, saying, little bit of lube. <laughs> yeah, all the way around there. Put a little bit around there. Like so. I'll put a little bit on the thing as well. There you go. And just rub them in. So these all done. So in theory then, that should be on the outside, like so. And then you have the three pieces go in the middle. Go for number six there. Right, so three, four, so they should go in. So we need to get these little pieces out here. One, two and three. Cool. They are a bit stiff. Again, sandpaper time. Give them a bit of a clean up. Hi, Hugh. Hi, everyone. It is in the chat, by the way. Any questions on this kit, let me know. Or if you just want to have a little chat about modelling itself, any thoughts? Second one, third one here. Cool, so that's around that way and this one needs to go in here. So we put that one in. There, then that one goes in. If he goes in, ah, he's a bit tight. Mm. There he goes. In he goes, right? So, them one's there, and this one then goes on this side onto there. Whoops, Let's twist him a little bit. And come on, a little bit of fidgety bit. There you go. One, two, three, and boom. There it is. There's the first section in. Just push that one in a bit. So I think this is the clutch bit here. And then you can see there's the picture there on this on the thing. That's what it should look like. That round that side, that round that side, which is good. So there's that section done. So then you need to go on to this page now, which is uh, we need number nine with the with the R elastic band, which is this one. So where's number nine to? That's number nine there. Let's make sure we get it all. So we got nine and that's the separate. So number nine, we get number nine out. There goes. They do push out quite easily, actually. I was expecting them to be a bit more harder. I've dropped it on the floor. Shocking. Just give that a little bit of a clean up. And I'm assuming that fits in there. So you put one in. 
like so. And you get, and then you push the other one in underneath. Ah, get in. Well, it's quite the the gap, I suppose, has got to be tight for the elastic band. He's in, then pull him tight. Put him a bit tighter, I think. A bit more tight. A bit more tight. And apparently, it should look like that and then around like that. That's what it should look like, going by the instructions there. So we'll leave that to one side. And then you need piece number five, which is this little piece here, which you've got to be careful of. Careful, I don't break him off too much. So he, ah. there you go. Just give him a little. Oh, look at that! Perfect. Another bit of cleanup required on that little piece there, just to get rid of the notch. These are very handy. These flexi file cut and trims. If you can get some, get some. They're brilliant. I don't know where I got them from. So, so what have we got in the chat then? We've got 12 people watching at the moment. Yeah, we do, Plastic Alchemist. We do need to do a chat. We do need to have a chat and do a live stream together, most definitely. Um, now I've got a little bit more time on a Thursday because I, I don't go to Magic Society as much. I only go there once a month now. We haven't got so many meetings. I'll be able to do it. Get a bit of a clean up as well. Get them looking flat. They don't take a lot to clean up these, which is very good, very useful. So, looking at this, it, I think it goes like that. And then you put, you need number six, which is this one here. That's, oh yeah, that's number six there. We use the tool and push out. There you go. Bit of a clean up. I was told um, to clean these up so I, I, um, as much as you can because it will help later on. It's like clearing up a sprue really, isn't it? So, the orientation is, it looks like that. So you want that this way then, I guess. So that, because there's, there's, so it's showing, it's showing um, that. So you want to push that. It looks like it's square on. So it goes over the top in there. So that's where it screws onto there or pushes onto there. And then you need number five, which it goes on the outside there. And that pushes on to there. So there should be a gap and that swings around there. That looks good to me. That's looking good. And then push tight. He's pushed tight to be fair. He's in, he's in close. It looks like there's a bit of a gap there. Let's just push it. That really goes any further. That's it. No way, Jose. So there's that part done. Number seven, which is the elastic band, which goes out to there. Cool. Right. Open up. <clears throat> so you've got number 11 now. And needs a little bit of wax. Doesn't say as far as the wax goes in there. So number eleven, which is there, we'll just push him out. Yeah, what sort of build are you looking at? Um, plastic would be really good. Push him out. It's a little bit tight. There you go. Oh, you don't need that much clean up. He just he just fell out. This one. <laughs> a little bit of clean up. And so this is on the outside. It needs a tiny bit of wax on it, which we'll put a bit of wax on. Yeah. And that slots, if that's around there, that must slot just straight on. Where's the groove? There's the groove on top. Should be two little grooves, is there? Oh, I can't see two little grooves. So that goes on outside uh, 
I'm not missing a piece here, am I? Well, there is another piece there. Sorry, number 10 needs to go on as well. Right, where's number 10? There. I have got number 10 on. That's why I'm, I'm, I've missed that piece there. Look at how easy was that? Number 5 goes on, then number 10. So number 10 goes on. Let's give a bit of a push out. Cool. Clean up. And that goes underneath there. And so number 10 goes in there. Is that number 10? Number 10. A bit concerned here. Have I got these the right way around? Because the way I can see it there. The instructions aren't really showing me. You've got the little notch there. But number 10 won't fit on there. Or have I got it that way? Hmm. Hmm, interesting. There is a gap there. Or does it go the other way? There is a gap, so I'm assuming you've got to push really... Oh, hang on. So maybe you do have to push really hard to get this on. Or... Mm, right. That looks really hard to get on. I'm going to make sure it's got to be... To, it's that direction there. And you've got the lines there. So it goes on like that. And it looks like you pushed them on hard. But that is really, really... Get a little bit in. Get... I've got to push him on hard, have I? I don't want to break it. Cool. I wonder if I put a tiny bit of wax on there. It may help it go over. A little bit of wax there. A little bit of wax there. Make sure it's lined up to there. And come on. Come on. Cool. He is tough, man. Cool. <sighs> Plastic is that the Sky Master? <laughs> cool. He's not going on, is he? Oh, come on. There you go. He's on. Ah, there you go. He's on. Come on. Push a bit more. There. So it looks like that's now on. One, two, three. And then this piece here allegedly fits on the end here. There you go. So you should have one, two, three, four. Cool. You should have a bit of wax on the end. And you need number seven. So you need some sevens now which are here. Oh, I've got to get this right now, hang on. 
So looking at that, it should look like this. It looks pretty good to me, going by that picture. And then that, then, allegedly fits on here. Just looking now, making sure. Yeah. You get these two little seven bits. Mm. And apparently, they look like that and they go here. It that way is that right so that one goes up this one goes down so it look like that yeah and then this fits on there Okay. Ah, there you go. With a kick in there. And then you need number eight, which is this one. Oh, come on. It goes in there. Straight up. And that locks in. So you can see the me me mechanism there. It turns this way, but then as it turns, it, it, they're like the teeth cut in. What a clever design. So they could go backwards, they don't cut in, but as soon as they, they cut in there, see, they actually hit right in there. What a clever design that is. That fixes onto there. And you need number 12 now, which is this one. Bit of a clean up required. I might just get that quick clean up while it's there, actually. Let's just clean that up a minute. Cool. And then this one here, a bit of a clean up. It would be good plastic if we all like had like a, a project that like four of us were on camera every night just building a model. That would be excellent. And then this one here goes on to there. And it'd be tight as well, because there they are, that's tight. And let me just get a bit more of a rub off there. I'm not quite happy with that. It does come with a little bit of sandpaper, actually. I wonder what grit that is. There we go. Look at that. Brilliant. So I'm really chuffed with that. So it goes that way, it doesn't doesn't kick, but then when it twins, it bang, there it goes, it kicks in. Fan bloody tastic. So they're in. A little bit of wax needed on here to help with the uh brilliant. And he goes, it shows you the diagram there. From this position here, you can see you've got one, two, three, and the elastic band coming off there. Oh, it's come out actually. And you go, oh no, go on, push him in. Mm. Not as good as I think that. And then, and that goes out through the hole there. Come on. Just make sure he goes in. Into that groove there. Perfect. And then this must swing out through there and that pushes down excellent it comes out that way cool excellent that looks pretty cool that and there it is just set up there so you can see exactly what you've done now then we move on to this one here and you need number 13 so there's number 13 there, we'll push him out, let's move this out of the way. Number 13, so we start one end and then go the other end. 
caught them pushing through. Come on. Oh, there you go. He's now broke his fruit. Come on. Brilliant. There you go. Just seeing that is good. He's a bit of a clean up. Once a week we can manage. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'm, I'm, as I say, most week, most Thursdays I'm, I'm now available. I'm not doing live streams or anything for magic or nothing like that for the society. So, yeah. Brilliant. So that's that one. Now we've got to look at the rotation. And I'm looking at a, a drop there, that side. So it should be a little drop there. That's good. Little drop that side. Yep, got that. Let me just clean this up a little bit. So you got that drop, drop, brilliant. And then you will need 14, 15, and 16. Wow. So 14. Come on, you come. Oh. Didn't break off as clean as you'd like, is it? So let's get the old razor blade and just give that a bit of a trim. Come on, there you come. Uh, perfect. Come on. That's that one done. Come through. Clean up. Brilliant. There's a little tiny piece there as well. So, right, that's cleaned up. So, yeah, you need to cut the little notches out, which I've done. Just get in there with that. Cool, right, marvellous. And then so you've got to put this one until it gets to the very end. It's quite a tight fit, it feels like. Ah, cool. It is hell of a tight, you know. Ah. If I was to go up, warning, yeah. I should go right the orientation. Yeah, I've got the right orientation. I should go right up there. right tight he is no so I'm gonna get this one in use how the yeah that's right use the wax but oh that little dot is there and he should just go straight on let me just uh Clean this up a little bit. I know it's going to be quite tight, some of these pieces. They told me that. It shouldn't be that tight. Let's clean them up a little bit. There you go. And then it looks like there's a little bit of a... All you need is millimetres. So there's the dot. That goes on there. And push him on. There you go. Bang. He's on now. Then you've got number 16 and number 15, which is here. Number 16, number 15. Clean them up a little bit. Evening PFS modeling projects. How are you, sir? Oh, By the way, the, the link to buy these, because it's a Kickstarter, if you want to buy one of these models, you can go onto the Kickstarter and um, and have a look. There's a link in the description. If you can do it after the live feed, that'd be good. And um, 
and have a look. I've, do you know what? I've, to be honest with you, I've not had a really good look yet because it only went live. I think it only went live today because it wasn't live yesterday when I looked. So, um, so number 16. That goes on there. Does it go that way? It goes that way on. So that's number 16. So he's got to go in tight. He's in tight, nearly. That's in tight. Then what we'll do is give us a bit of a clean up here. We've got number 15 to go on there as well. There you go, he's in as well. And he's in. Uh, right. Now you've got 16 and 15 this way. 16. Trouble is, though, once you've put it on, you can't see what the orientation is now, can you? I'm assuming it is that way and not that way. Hmm. Right. Anyway, I have to carry on because I don't know what the orientation is. Orientation is now. So we've got number sixteen first. Clean up. Get these together. Right, so he goes on up to that point there. He's in tight now. The last was number 15. We've still, only, still got a hell of a lot to do. I'll just go in here and give this a quick rub down. He goes on there and push him up. There you go. So he's on there and he's on there. No, wrong way round. Bugger. Bugger, bugger. Come on, you come, please. Oh, I wasn't paying attention then. I was looking at the chat. <laughs> oh, no. He's coming. Let's get him off. He's off. You gotta go this way. Cool, oh, saved it. There you go, and he's on there. So there's them two done now. And then they say a little bit of wax on here. So we'll put a bit of wax on that wheel and that wheel. And uh, also on the on here as well. And then some wax on the these here, the smaller one it says. Onto the smaller one. That's cool. That's them bits done. And then we get the chassis out now. So we're looking at 17 and 18 now. Just make sure we've done everything on that way. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. There you are. Let's uh, push him out. There you go. Nice and easy. Now it's getting less on the sprue. The sprue feels a bit weaker. Now it's got less parts on it. There you go. Oh. Careful on that. There you go. Push him around. Oh, there you go. Come on. Cool. Last bit. There we are. Look at that. Perfect. Quick clean up. I would... That's come off quite nice, actually. That is actually come off quite nice. Perfect. There you go. I'm not that's oh, a little bit of a little bit there. Take 
this one out. Cool. There we are. Right, there you go. So back to the instructions. Uh, number 18, which are these. And it looks like they, um, they're they made like so. And then, so we want it that way round and they fit in the two pins at the top. So one will obviously go in there. Perfect. That's him. Push him right in. That's him. And I suppose this one here, give him a bit of a clean up. I forgot to clean them up actually. Yeah, I've I've only ever built one, and that was more with matchsticks. And <laughs> when it comes to kits, uh, spring glue. If you folks could share this uh, live stream out and get some more people in, that would be fantastic. So he's in, and he needs to go in that little notch there. Um, perfect. He is. He's in. He's in. Right. Let's put them up there out of the way. Okay. So then you need number 19, which is there. Push him out. Cool. A little bit of trim up there. A little bit of clip. Where's that? Um... I've got somewhere, there you go. Let's get the old Flory models one out, shall we? Let's give them a bit of a clean. That's better. Right, so do you check the orientation of this? It's saying 19 on the front of it. I think there's a mistake there. <laughs> so remember 19 goes to the front then. Let me just quickly check that around. Right. So number 19. That goes in there. In he goes. Perfect. And it's saying that you need an elastic band now. The elastic band here. But doesn't quite say... How it goes in. Right. Let's turn this over. So allegedly that goes around, does it? That goes around there, like so. And in the groove. Which is good. Push him back through. That's him. Right. And then, this is where you get the steering starting, I think. So, you will need number 20 and number 20. So, you have two 20s, which is here. That's number one and number two. Let's give him a push out there. Oh. Sometimes it sounds like it's breaking. Whoops. I am stream building the Martian tripod. Oh, fair play, mate. Which manufacturer is that one? He looks pretty clean. Right, there's the first one. And I'm assuming it goes in. Right. So it looks like it goes in like that. Or in the top one. Is that right? Ah, there you go. Cooking on gas now.
the laser art company fair play and that one fits in there like so look at that there you go and so number five now you need number 21 to fit on top so number 21 which is this one out it comes Slight cleanup needed, not a lot though. And so there and there, which doesn't say what orientation, that fits on the top of them. So that fits there on top of that one. Well, that's it. And then it will go on to that one there. A little bit of movement. Come on. And you get so he's pushed in he needs a little bit of persuasion so there you go he's slotted in and he's got to be tight apparently so there he is tight there's elastic band in there nice and tight coolio and there's the part of the steering and i think that's all you do with that on 21 and then you need number 22, which goes in front, which is this piece here. And a little bit of uh, a bit of clean up, get with the, uh, that's him. Cool. That's that one. Doesn't say which way it goes, does it? Let's have a look. Ah, so you want that one there, up there. And he goes, slap bang there, by what I can see. Yep, so he goes in that little hole there. Little hole there. If they could highlight the hole a bit more, that would have been a bit better on this instruction sheet. I have done ROKO bills too. Oh, fair play to you, mate. I've never done one. Now you're number 25. Push him out. And so there must be a way of doing this carefully. So you crisscross and put it over there, do you? So this comes out. So where does that fit into? Either side. So this looks like it's going to be a bit of fun. Um, I'll get these. I'll put them out. Crisscross. Crisscross them. Like so. So I wonder what would be the best way of doing this. I suppose the best way would be to pull them through, hook one. Whoops. Of course, it's going to be a bit. Because these elastic bands are quite tight, believe it or not. So let's just put them in like so. Come on. There's the first one. There's the second one. So if I, in theory, twist that. Oh, I can't. It's upside down, isn't it? Ah, you swine. Ah. Right. Okay. Let's try it this way then. So we'll put him in, like, we'll just move these out of the way a minute. And we'll get the elastic band on top and around, like so which is good and then we pull it out and twist him around like so is he still he's still in there move him to there and get him in that's him move him around to there and there you go perfect you see that that's the steering done now so what i do instead of doing it by the instructions basically it's saying twist the elastic band around and put it in. What I do is I turn this piece upside down and then pull the whole piece around to make it easier to get it to slot. And there you go, there's your elasticated. That's brilliant, that. Clever, very clever, I like that a lot. And he fits in there and I don't think he'll jump out. Oh, hang on, he's coming out there. So if I just, 
That's there you go. Perfect. There you go. Can't say better than that. I think that's a good little system, that. So, turn them around. You're on to page number one now. Uh, no, we're on page 14. Have we missed anything here? Da, 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 da. No, I can't see anything we've missed. So, we're halfway through the booklet. So, we're almost cooking on gas, ladies and gentlemen. And we're still on the only, only on the top spring. Right, so what do we need now? We need number one, which is... Sorry, no, we need number 24 and number 23. So, number 24 is the steering wheel. Let's clear him up. How are we doing so far? 45 minutes so far. Not bad going, is it? And then we'll just clean this up a little bit. Cool. Marvellous. So there's that one. Then number 23, which is here. Push him out. Carefully. Ah, it's got a little piece in there. So you need to get that piece out as well. He's coming out. Good. So that looks good. That looks good. I'm assuming then, so looking like that into there, this is going to be a tight one again, I guess. In he goes into his push tight. There he is. So there's the steering wheel. We'll put that to one side. Now we've got to do the chair. So everything on this sprue now is empty, gone. There's nothing else to use, so that can now go. And we need the chair one, which is, a shame they haven't got the image here of the um, where the chair is, because this is a different one. So you've got to turn over for the chair. Uh, yeah, so we're needing now 27, 26, 28. So 27, <sighs> push that one through, 27. 26, yeah, and 28. Brilliant. Okay, so instructions are saying you've got the back piece there. A little bit of a clean up required on that one there and on that. Make sure it's all cleaned up. Then along there, he's done, done, done. Right, so I'm sure, in, so you want the red on the front and then you put that. Oh, it's a bit nasty little car there. Right, red, red there. Okay, it doesn't really matter. So that fits on to there. So there's the seat on, and then this one here, the red up, must fit in there. It's a bit tight then. Clean up time. Nice. Cool, right, I'm doing it a bit backwards here, I think. I should have done it the other way, but it doesn't matter now. That one, I don't think it matters which way it goes in. I think it goes in that way. So you've got red showing, red showing. Then this one here is the same. It slots in that one there. And that there. Come on. There you go. And pushes in, clicks in, and basically, there's your seat. Slight clean up on the, then I might be tight getting in, because this is gonna end up on the, sh on the chassis. Any questions, leave them in the chat and I'll answer them. You can even talk about me about football. I love football as well, <laughs> if you wanna talk about football. Uh, 
or anything about modeling, definitely. So got that, got that, got that. And, oh, so we're keeping that to one side as well. So now it looks like we've got to start. That's weird, I thought they would have put the older thing on. So we have this section here, which is this. And this must go along the back this way, which I'm fine with. And that hooks in there. So that comes out of that one around there and that hooks into there. Hmm, I think they would have been better off. I want to use this, to, I want to do it a different way than what the instructions are saying. So that goes in like so, and that goes around, which is good. And then that fits in to that bit there. So I'm going to... Push that plastic band through. Little pair of pliers here. Little, which isn't... Push that through there. So he's gone through. hooks oh damn it all right make sure we get it right it goes on that way into there there's a pushing through Oh, you are joking me. It's going to be a fiddly job this is, I'll tell you. Oh, right. Let's start again then with that one. So, he's now in that position there. And we've got to get that into there. It's getting fiddly now, lads, isn't it? <clears throat> Hi Barry, 345 Barry, hope you're well. You know, the, the instructions are a little bit devious on this because oh, I've got it the wrong way around, have I? That's right, I've got to put that way out. Bugger. So a little so it goes on there like that, right? And then in yeah. It's a little bit deceptive. But it's just to challenge you, these models anyway, so I like a challenge anyway. So that goes in there and he's there. And then this one here must go into that hole there. Push him in. Hmm. Right, note to self. Make sure that's right. That swings around there, so it's got to go in that way. Right. Okay. Elastic bands going in. Right. So he goes into that groove. He goes into that groove. He goes. Oh, you bastard! says no glue, but I'm tempted to glue that bugger on. Get in. Then the thing moves. Anyway, right, I because I can't see how that's going to attach on there and hold there, because it's not, is it? 
That's not. That's no way going to hold on there for a minute. I was looking. Okay, right. That's on there, like so. And then you need 29 and 30. So 29. Get 29 out. And we'll have to look at that in a bit because that's just wound me up. It's come out, but I kind of guessed it would. But it's not really held in there. It, you know, I'm tempted to glue that bugger in. So there's 29, which fits in to there. One and two. So he goes in tight. He goes in tight. Cool. So there's that one. Then number 30 goes this side. There's number 30. And he goes in there. And he goes into that one there. Cool. Go on, slot in your bugger. There's one. There's two. He's in. Right. Perfect. And it's still steering, that's fine. And then you've got that one and that one, that's the front, yeah. So I'll get that though. One to twelve. That's piece one to twelve, right. Alright. So in theory then you need to put that in so you can put the So you can put the seat in. Oh, you bugger. Oh, dear me. So, try again. Attach the bugger on there. Have I got some different... Yeah, if you just go take them off. Yeah, I'm thinking that. But it looks like you've got to put it under the steering wheel. So, let's get these ones out a minute. Let's try that first. So, he goes over there. Right. Right. Then open it up. That's the first one in. Then the bugger spins. Right. That's the first one in. Get in, get in, quick, quick. Right. He's in the groove now. That goes pushed back. And, ah, he's come out again. I'm tempted to glue that little bit in. Because he's moving, he's quite loose there. I am tempted to put a bit of glue in there. A bit of super glue. Because he is moving. Anyway, if I, and the, and the elastic's got a little chink out of it now as well. Mm. What time is it? It is eight o'clock, so we've got, let's uh, hold him into position there.
con él. Get in. Get in. Right. Oh, he's come out again, you fucker. Yeah, I think he needs to be glued in. I think that needs to be glued. And I'm going to glue it. Yeah. I'm going to glue it. I'm going to glue it. And I need some super glue. <clears throat> I'm going to I'm gonna have to glue it in. There's no other way around it. I can't see any way. So, fortunately, we're going to have to do... Uh, glue that piece in carefully mind so I don't want it to to move so that's in there and if I put a little dab of glue on that where's me uh where's me look I use this old tin actually because it's uh, a little bit of super glue in there that's all I need get that and dab in there the littlest bit of super glue. And I hope that will make it stay into position. I would use a lot of glue, just enough to keep that one there into position. So, he looks pretty solid in there now. Just the tiniest bit of glue required on that one. Which is a shame, because I was hoping not to use glue. But I can't get it to go in because it keeps falling out. It keeps moving. And that's it. He's now in position. There. And if I pull him back around to there, which way is it though? It's the other way, isn't it? And in there, hopefully, That elastic band will stay in position as much as I can. Keep it into position. Ah, what's that? Truck? Ah, the sharp these. Get in to there. That's where it needs to be. It's got a bit of a. Oh, unbelievable. So it's got to go that way and under, isn't it? Unbelievable. That way. And then under. No, oh, I'm getting annoyed with this. And I think I've ruined the elastic band because there's a little notch in it now. But that's what it's saying. That's got to go in there like so. And pull back. Oh, hi Plastic Monkey, how are you? Hi Scaly Muddles, hi Mark. I'm in a bit of a drama here, lads, with this bloody elastic band job. That goes in there, right.
and then it goes that way and under it's got to stay in there that's the that's the the crux of it it's got to stay in there and he's in now and then this one here as long as he's not twisted Needs to go back in there. Elastic bands are the hardest at the best of times anyway. He goes there. Oh. That's him. He's there. And you've got to put the chair in now. So the chair can go in. Ah, got him. Bit of perseverance on that bugger. Don't want to lose it now. So he goes there. On the elastic band. That's right. But I don't want to... Right. If he comes out, I'll cry. Oh, he's come out! Fuck. Right, and leave that elastic band off there. I, I've, I've, it's quite tempted to let it not have elastic band, to be honest. Right, so number 31, which is the bit I was looking forward to because this is very well made. You've got to be careful to get it out, but it's like it's cut in a particular way to bend. You can see there's a bend in it. If you do that, very clever. Clean up required. Get the front there. Perfect. So this one goes into that edge there. In he goes. One and two. And it bends over into position into there. So you go one and two. Brilliant. There he is. And there's the front end of it. Good click. Bit, bit of pressure click there you go and click look at that for the front i'm quite pleased with that that looks pretty good pretty good at this point i would be cursing the build yeah this elastic band bollocks it is but then i suppose you could change elastic band i, I the elastic band looks crap anyway i think i've buggered the elastic band so <coughs> the seat goes in that goes in and then you need to put in number six is number 32 and 33. So 32 and 33. 32 is that one. 33 is that one. So 33, if it comes out in one piece, which it does, gently. So number 33, if it's that way round, it goes in there, does it? Oh, that was it. That's right. Was it that way? Uh, I think it's that way. So 33, and that goes into that slot. Hmm. There and there. That's quite good. I get them in. If I slot them in this side, actually. So he goes in there. Come on. Bit of a clean up required on that one. Make sure he goes in. But that elastic band, what an absolute. <sighs> By the way, Google's channel's not made for kids. It's not made for kids, it's for adults. That elastic band's a, a pain in the ass. So, number 33 goes into there, like so. Is that right? Oh, it goes. That one's in. And then you need this one here as well. So you've got that on the bottom. Have a clean up. Yeah, that elastic band. But the trouble is the way it's done, you just can't, it's not fixed. So as soon as you let go of the thing, it comes off. So 
I may have another elastic band I can use and change it. Because I have kind of wrecked the elastic band by using tweezers to get the thing on. Ah. Apart that, I'm really enjoying the build. It's coming through really well. Some really nice pieces and really nice ideas for this kit as well. That's him. Right, so that one and that one. 34 and 35 on the back. So 34. A little bit of clean up required. So 34 goes in there. Cool. And then 35 the other side. Like clean up. Hi, Ice Queen. How are you? Oh, cursing the build. Yeah. There's no filler needed here, but I, as I said, I have glued that piece in because it does move. That goes in there. So that's them bits done. Still, that's no way that thing's going to stay there with that tension on the elastic band. So number eight is showing you. I missed a piece, have I? There's no way that's staying on there, is it? That's in there like that. But how does that hold on to there? Ah, oh, no? Number eight. What have I missed out here? Right, so 36. 36. Is, is I using the wrong elastic bands? Ah. Oh. No. Just had a thought then, am I using the wrong elastic band? I'm just looking through, because that looks white to me. Have I used the wrong, am I being thick? Am I using the wrong elastic band? Because they all look fucking yellow to me. Right. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, they look yellow to me. Ah. Uh. You got a smaller and a larger. After all that, after all that, that's the one I need them. You are having a giraffe. In my next episode. <laughs> right. It looks bloody white to me, this one, not yellow. Let's see, so that one will fit under there. There he goes. Oh, you swine.
doll. You're telling me. Hi, Dominator. How you doing, mate? Nice video. Oh, he's... Oh, I just want to swear at the thing. Oh. Well, I hope this is the right one anyway. This white one. I'm putting the white one in anyway now because the yellow one's buggered anyway. Get in. Right. For everything else is MasterCard. Right, he goes in. Boom. Get in. Push him through. That's him. So we use the fat, the flat, the flat ones. And then we will push him in to there. Right, so I've done that. This one here has to go under the seat. So we'll go in there and push him up and try and grab the end. Put him free. Right, there we go. So that one's done and that one's done. Right, we're gonna leave him hanging out for now. So you hope you don't drop in. And apparently we need, on the instructions here, we need number 36, 38, 37. So it looks like you've got a bit of a, a bit of a player here. So this one here, 36 first. Whoops, comes out. And I'm assuming it fits. So you want to put that in there, have you? Is that right, the first hole or the second hole? So it goes in the first hole. So he spins. Okay, he's that's good. It's like that's how it's set up there, is it? Back end. So I don't know what that is, that's eight, number eight. I can't see. So it's looking at it from that angle, isn't it? So that goes in like so, I think. I'm hoping that's right. So you've got that and got that there, right. And then that goes in that hole. That other piece here goes into there allegedly okay this is looking a bit more promising we need 38 now we'll just push 38 out while I'm on a roll <laughs> They are, they are a bit fetchy, mate. That goes in there, does it? So that goes in there, right? That goes in together there. Before I do that, I've waxed them anyway, so that's fine. That goes in there, that goes there. And then you need 37 to put them together. Right, and then number 37. Okay, moment of bloody truth. That goes in there. Right, 
Right. Where's that other one there? So he goes in there like so. He goes in there and he goes in the front one. So in he goes, in he goes. He's got to come up. He's got to fit in there. Right. Oh dear. He goes in. Right, so he, that goes in that one. That goes in there. Cool, he's locked in there. And he goes out the back. He needs to be pushed in a bit more. So he's straight a bit, yeah. Come on, in you get. He's in, all right, he's in. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there's the spin. And he must have to go in that little hole there. Come on. Push in. Come on. He's in. Yeah. He's in. Oh. Wow. There you go, Idaho. He's in. Wow, we. And I assume then that's the wheels there. If I pull him, here we go. Let's moment of truth now, shall we? If I pull him and just and just make sure he's straight. And put him at the side there. Into that there. Let him go. Whoops. There he is in that one. If I just make him stretch a minute, I need to make him stretch, don't I? Oh. Okay. If I'm careful... If I just stretch him a little bit first, yeah, he's in. Stretch him, and then pull him around. Oh, don't let go. And then carefully put him there. Keep twisting. There you go. Whoa. Oh, get him in there quick. Quick, come on, don't lose him. Really put some tension on it. That's what it needs is some proper tension. There we go. Still not perfect, but he's good enough. He's good enough for me. That's good. Right. Let's put this little piece back on here. He came off. Go on, in you get. There you go. So he's in, he's in, he's in. That's good. Right. Whoa. What a stress. That's in, that's in, that's in. Right. Cool. That goes in there. That's all done. Yeah, that's done. That's done. Number four. So the, this here now, which is the steering wheel. Goes in there. And that hooks on there. Ah. Another challenge.
Let me just check. So that goes in there. The elastic band. There you go. So that goes, slots in there, that elastic band. There's a little hole inside there. It's a little tiny hole. If you can see that, let me just stand up and have a look. Whoops, just moved the camera. There's a little tiny hole in there. You'll see it when you look. That flops in. And there's the uh, steering wheel underneath. And all you've got to do then is put that over the top. And you have steering. There's the steering. Oh, now we're cooking on gas, everyone. We're cooking on gas. That one's finished now, is it? Oh, no, number 40. Look for number 40 here. Got 39. Where's 42? 39. There's 40. That's okay. So number 39 next on this one. Cool. Looks like a faff moss. It is a bit of a faff. But it's still a very, very interesting kit. I'm not going to deny it. I'm thoroughly enjoying building it. And besides, there'll be no need for um, weathering after. Or spraying. Ah! Right. So that one there. Quick clean up. Don't need a lot, really. Oh, is that not cut through? Have I got to break that off? Looks like I've got to break that off. Is that not cut through proper? Let's uh, quick check. No, it's got to come off. So quick cut with a craft knife. Let's cut them off. There you go. Clean up. Let's clean up on that. So this one here goes uh, so it's that way round, and that goes in. So it must go into all these different holes. So wow, there's one hole there, which has got to be pushed in, and there and there, and there and there. So there's, a, there's got to be a bit of a a wiggle wiggle on this one to get this one in. So. He's in. Let's push him in a bit more there. Push him up a bit. There you go. So he should go in now. That should go in. Let's put him out a little bit. Whoops. So he's, he's in now. So one, two. He's a little bit tight there. That's him. That's him. One, two. Oh, look at that. Oh, when he goes in, they go in, don't they? That's him. He needs to be pushing a bit more. That's him. There you go, look at that. There's the race car done there. Cool. Push me in a little bit. He goes in there, that can, is that gonna go down a little bit? That's him. So he's in tight now, all around. Perfect, look at it, it's like a position bit of kit. So that's in there. So number eight, number nine. Yeah, I'm looking at that now. Um, and then you've got number 40 and 42 and 41. So there's number 40 on that board. And that's another board finished. 40 and we've got 41 up on this one. We'll push him out using the tool. That's him. The 41's out. No, he's not. But he is now. 41. And what is it? So we've got... 40 41 and 42 which is this piece here and in theory then so we look at this and looking at that looking that way around or is it that way that's that way around is it so a quick look one two yeah i think it's that way around and that fits in the top of that one so he goes in first i guess Come on, let's have a little bit of a clean up. Let's have a bit of a clean up, shall we? Bit of a clean up. Because there's no, it's going to be a bit of a ball ache to get this done. It's going to be tight. Mercy, what should like in the end? Yeah. If you. Um, if you go to the latest review on this kit, you'll see it there, matey. 
is it will look like a racing car, Formula One car. They can't use the word Formula One because it is copyrighted, apparently. So that's right. Bomb, bomb, bomb. He goes through there smoothly. Yeah, this one here goes on the front. Perfect. Then you have... Right, so you've got 43. Which I'm assuming doesn't actually just sits on the top. So you've got 43. Which goes next. I'm assuming it's that one there. I think, is that right or is that not right? 43. I may have got this wrong. So 43 and 44. So 43. Goes in. So it looks like it goes a bit higher, but we'll see. So 43. Let's get a 44 out a minute. Uh, 44 that goes in which it doesn't come on the other way right 43 there you go, 43, 44, and then 45, 45, come on, out he comes, 45, and then 46, we'll do that at the same time, so then 45, just uh, get to slot in, there you go, that's 45, then you've got 46 on the very end, is that the white way around or is that not the white way around? Let's have a quick nose. Hang on, let's get it. turn him around. There you go. That looks about right to me. Okay. 42, 45, 46, 46 at the very end. And then, so you need to put the uh, 45, 46. Then... Where's that to? We missing the page here. Where's those? Well, I'm assuming. Oh yeah. So you got forty-seven and forty-eight. That's a bit weird, isn't it? That should be a. It's backwards. Why have they done that? Right. So forty-eight. Let's do forty-eight. Forty-seven. So, 48 on the right, and then these all should just slot in nicely. He says. <laughs> Come on. That's tight. Oh, God. Well, he's in, and that should just slot on the top then, should it? Right. We need a bit of a gap there. There's supposed to be a gap. Yeah, because you don't go in the first two, you only go... So, try this side then now. One, two, three. There you go, right. He's looking pretty well, he was lined up then, but he's not now. Right, one, two, three, and four. Push him in. Right, so he's in now, looking pretty good. And then that fits in to that one there, does it? Oh, look at that. 
Can't say further than that, can you? So he slot in there, nice and tight. Whoa, he's tight as well. And he goes in as well. That's the band's come off again. Bloody thing. Right, in he goes. And that one hooks around there. A bit of tension on it. I say a bit of tension. And then try and force him in that gap. Makes you want to put glue in it. Not just saying, not that you should, but to really get it to go in, just let him out a little bit, let him out a little bit, let him out a little bit. That's it. See, it comes off. That is a little bit crap. I'm just going to say, this is wound me up. I spent more time on the elastic band than anything, which is a shame because the model is actually very, very good. So I've not been asked to say anything apart from their marketing, as in, you know, that they've got a Kickstarter going. But this bloody elastic band palaver. Oh, he's gone smartly in there. Wonder if I could flick him over and do the same that way then. Get over there. See, he's just a little bit reluctant to do it. Go on. That's it. In you get. In you bloody get. He's right in there now. Let's go. Oh! Right, hopefully, no, he hasn't done it. Why? There's got to be an easier way of doing these elastic bands. I know, using the right ones, yeah, but. Right, anyway. Right, anyway, that's the band is a is a it's a bit of a red red. Right, it's good and done, 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 done. That's done now. So you'll push it in nice and tight. So you've got the side bits now, which is uh, number forty nine. And uh, all we've got to really do now, I think we're nearly close to just getting the uh, um, what's it called? It's done forty nine, fifty one, and fifty. So there's fifty there. We're almost done here, gentlemen, and it's been an hour and a bit. So then, that apparently slots on there like so. Push him in. Wooden City, look at that. It's got Wooden City there. That's quite nice. Come on. Ah! Right, next one. In he comes. <sighs> Glad not the only chats to the... I'm not the only chat that chats to the parts, yeah. <laughs> I chat all the time, mate. I talk to myself. I got it from my father. My father used to do it as well. So he goes in tight. He goes, they go, look at that. They're flush as assholes. They really are good. They are flush. Then this one here, you've got motor. So this one goes on this side. And that must go. Oh, where's it going, mate? Yeah, that's it. So this one, this side, sorry. That fits in there. That fits in there. Push him down. I won't push him down, actually, because the wheel's hanging out. Go on in, you get. There you go. Cool. He's in, and then this one here. Motor on the side, so whoops, that way round, isn't it? Yeah. And there. Oh, come on. In you get. Oh, he's tight. Ah, there you go. Oh. Perfect. Perfect. Not quite tight there. There he is now. Look at his flush. Look at that. That's coming on really, really well now. So what they've got in here now then. So we've got them bits on the side. That's good. Then you have 54 and 54A. So 54 and 50, which are the, which I would assume are the um, mirrors. He's out. So you've got this one here. Goes in 
that very top one there. There you go, in he is. Here's the first one in. And like I said, they are they're tight, but they do go in. You've got to really push sometimes. Keep your beak out, scale modelly. <laughs> Brilliant. So there's the uh, bits in there. That's good. So how are we cooking on now? So we've got that. The last. So we've got put them on. That's good. Three. Number four. Yeah, that's the mirrors. Make sure they're the right orientation. Number five is these. So you've got to get these out first. Whoops. Number number five and number five. 52 and 53. Oh, it's 52 and 53 as well. So 52, 53. Slight cleanup required on that one. Let's use the, uh, the old Mr. Flory. That's the first one. Cool. And from 53 goes on the end there. Come on. Boom. He's in. You feel it? It's like he just kind of just needs a little bit of a very slight persuasion and then they're in. Right. Very slight persuasion and then they go in. Go. Yeah, he's in as well. Cool. That's that done. So that's done, that's done. Then we've got these ones here. 55 that go on here. You want to push them up. So get the right orientation on these as well. Get the, uh, make sure we, we clean these up clean. Because these are going to be tight to get on. So you're looking lengthways, I guess. That's widthways. In he goes. Don't get these wrong, so you want to go that way. Perfect. That's them two in. Bom, bom, bom. And they're saying a bit of wax. So a bit of wax on these as well then. Slight bit of wax. How are we doing? Oh, it's quarter to nine. They said three hours, but I'm two hours in, aren't I? So around hour and a quarter in. We might be done in two hours with this one. So that one's in. And then we've got to start making these up. So this one goes off. And we need 64 and 60 and 62. So we've got 64. Sixty-four. Then we have a sixty. Okay. And then we have sixty twos. So you've got one one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So you got four per wheel. Okay. Um I'll make sure we get these right because these are the wheels, aren't they? So, one, two, three, four. Okay. Now, allegedly, if you look at the wheels, I'm assuming go in that way. Okay. Okay, so you got that one. And then Okay. So you push them together like so.
Is that right? They're pushed quite together, so they must stick out a bit, so... Um... Right. I'm assuming that's how they go. Okay. And then you get your elastic band and your ruler. And you cut the elastic band like so. And you cut them to 80 millimeters. There's one centimeter, 80 millimeters. So if we put that on top, like so, that's dead on. saying 80 doesn't have to be exact and there it is there. there's the 80 mark so he goes you fold them over like that, okay? This is what's telling me they fit in there, and this piece here gets pushed in. I think you need two bloody hands for this. And you then, you've got to push them in, like so. All right, he's a little bit off, just a tad, but I can't do no more than, see, that's uh, bollocks. Right, here he goes, there's 80 mil. Gets him in there. Ah, uh, right. Right. And he gets forced in there. And this pin. Falls out. It's going to be upright. Come on. <sighs> Boom. Right. I am actually quite happy with that. Push him down a bit more. Where's the tool gone? Lost me toe. Cool. Right. So that's that one done. And then you put one the other. Oh, so it's got to be half and half, is it? There you are. Note to self, it's got to be half and half. That's cool. I'm going to do that again. Right, again. It's going to take the time, I think. It takes an hour to do each one. So that goes there. It's going to be half and half. He's in. All right. And come on. There you go. Half and half. 
Right, come on, there we go. So he's in halfway roughly. You just adjust it a little bit, there you go. No, it's come out again. Right. Right, he's halfway now. That can go halfway then. Oh. Come on, that's half. He's back a bit, half. He's got to be half as well. Come on. Yeah, he's half as well. And he is slightly sort of really that's him. Half on there. God, this is a bit fiddly, isn't it? And he goes, right, so that's half and half as well. Then you take a 56, which is one of these. And a 57. So a 57. So you're looking at it that way. Um, little chunk out there. Right. So from that way, that goes on there. Come on. That's in. He's in. He's in. He's in. Oh, you bugger. Mm. Right. He's not going in, is he? The rest are in, almost. That one's not in either. So. If I... Uh, right. So you need a 56 on the front. Oh, fidgy, fidgy. See, that needs to be the... Ah, it's one fitter than the other then, is it? Oh, there's got to be something wrong here. That's, that's flush, that's flush. See, this bugger here. And they all look flush as well, but he's off to the side. Oh. Not as easy as you make out, Mr. Model Wooden City. Ah. Oh. He's in. Come on. Ah. Oh, you bugger. Right. I'm just going to... He's off the he's off as well though, isn't he? There's gotta be a way of doing this. Is there like a fatter one there? Uh one, two, three. So let's put him in there. And he can go in there. Yeah. He's ready to go in there. I'll just push him in a little bit. Right. Hmm. Just trying to work out the best way of doing it with the elastic band. Because at the moment, the elastic band is actually causing more issue than anything. Because he's not quite central. And which one of these are central then? None of them. They've all got... See, he can go in there. <coughs> yeah. 
not quite as easy as it they make out. Because he goes off to the centre, off to the side. Let me just look at this one here. I think it's totally different, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. And that pin's there. <clears throat> it goes to the back. So I'm assuming that they've made it bigger at the back. Yeah, so there it goes in there. It goes in there. And the rubber band slots in there to make it fit. Oh, that's a good adage, Mark. Measure twice, cut once, you're telling me, yeah. Just um, let's cheat a little bit. Let's get that pushed in there. Come on, I have to take him out of that pin. And down. Come on, nearly, nearly got him then. Last, it's the elastic bands. They they're gonna they're gonna destroy me. These elastic bands. Eagles in there. Make sure he's tight. Push him down and around. Come on, a bit more, come on, that's him, he's not quite in there is he? Right, push him in, push him around, that's him, and then you've got this wheel here, down start at the very top come on that's him he goes in ah got him i think we're cooking on gas here let's just make sure he goes in come on ah nearly Why that pin's going up there. Put him in. Oh, there you go. Right. God, that's an ass, that is. Why don't you get in, you bugger? Right, I've banged them in. I had to. Then they swing around. Well, out of the 80 millimetres is 8 centimetres. So you've got to go around twice then, is it? That ain't right, is it? Eight, 80 millimetres is 8 centimetres. What are you doing to me? What are you doing to me? Well, it's not 80 centimetres, is it? Right. Well, that's wrong. Clearly. And do you know what? I'm just going to put... I'm just going to glue him. I'm just going to glue them. Um, so that's gone to there. Around to there. These are going to have to be glued because there's no way that's going to work, is it? Is it twice around or is it just me? So.
Right, so I have to cut them off. He goes around to there. Bloody hell, honestly. Right, so it's not 80 mil then. So when you build these, they're not 80 mil. Right. So this first one's gonna have to be glued into position. It does say 80 mil, I'm not just being thick, am I? 80 mil and that one's 95 mil now they're the same um they're the same so model city you've got that wrong Oh, right. Right, so I've glued them. I've had to glue this one because it's just too... It wasn't going to happen. Right, so that's the first one glued. How much have I taken off of this one? eight centimeters I didn't do it 16 did I oh, I don't know what I've done here I really don't oh I'll tell you what I've done it was the wrong fucking end ignore me folks I'm tired I'm tired right so next one is 60 do the same again then do we the next one right 64 64 let's get these out back together one two one two is that the fat one there there's the fat one there that's what i've done i picked the wrong piece up didn't i i picked the wrong piece up I'll cut them. Oh, what a bum. What a bum. That's nine. That's eight. So ignore me, folks. One of those little errors, but there we go. We got it right in the end. <laughs> so that folds over like so. Get this blob of glue. Help that stick together. It's a pain in the ass else. And so you always put them to the back when you've got the little little pegs. Put them to the back and you'll be laughing. Come on. Where's me tool? One, two, three, and four. Right. 
So he's going in the centre, so that goes around there. Now this time, in theory, it should be easier to do because I've already done one. And they go in, if I look at the instructions, they go in upwards, don't they? Yeah. So he goes in, there's the first one in. Make sure he's centred. There you go, cool. Second one goes in, make sure he's centred as well. Oh, come on. Make sure he's centered as well. He's in as well. Is that centered? That's pretty good centered. Brilliant. Third one. So yeah, I was wrong with the elastic band. I cut, I cut it 80 and then picked the bit off that was the long bit. So my bad on that, but we made it work in the end, didn't we? So he's in. And that one's in as well. Needs a bit of a clean up. That's him. Take a little bit of the edge off because it'll make it easier to go in them. The centre. Cool. Right. Then you have 57 and 58. Elastic band with a little bit of glue on because I think it's easier. And remember it goes to the back because that's that, that one there and then you put your little pin in to make it easier come on and you get oh would that fall on my <gasps> fall on my leg it's all good in the hood a little bit of glue there for that elastic band and then we push in. Come on. Do you know what? Oh, I can't do it with this one, can I? If I did that and that pin. So fiddly. Could use a vice. Mm. Oh we got watch, you got eleven watch at the moment. That's brilliant. Come on, there you get. Right, that's that one in. Right, so that's the pins in. Cool. Ah. Right. So again, what do we need with the sport one on the back? Which we right way round. Yeah, that goes on the back there. That's in, that's in, let's get him in. Okay, so pretty much locked and loaded in that side. And, oh, nearly, nearly got him in. He didn't quite make it. So try again and push him down. <sighs> Hell of a tough, right. Him. Push him back a bit. That's him. Right, there we go. And the sport one. And then bag him in. That's him. And then they fold over. Oh, cool. There you are. And there's another wheel. So you've got two wheels there now. And then we've got the big ones to do. Right, so how do the, uh, right, 58, 59, so we've turned over now. Right, so we start again, so we've got a 65 and a 61. They end up together, fat and fat, that side there. 
cool. And then you need uh, a couple of these. We're nearly done, I think. Just the wheels to go on to build. Two, three, four. This needs to be 95. Which is near as damn it, to be fair. Right. And then we use a little bit of glue. Because I'm allowed to. Just a drop of glue there. Turn him over and together. <coughs> Brilliant. Makes it so much easier. And, and look, of course, any modelling, you can do what you like. Put this... Uh, they should be half and half, shouldn't they? Yeah, so we'll get them there. Put that in there. Come on. All right, half and half this time. Let's see if we can get it proper done this time. One, two. In he goes, right the way down. He's in. Cool. This time, do it again. Take a tiny smidgen off that one, because he's got a little bit of a... Uh... Oops, a little bit of a groove in that one. There you go. Uh, right, I've still got 10 in the chat, brilliant, nice to see you all in the chat by the way, cool, there we go, what time is it, it's uh, 2 hours and 15 minutes so far to get this one done, so it's about 3 hours then, but we had a bit of an issue with the old, uh, um, there he is, with the uh, elastic bands. So if you can get elastic bands done, you're laughing. Come on. Get in. So you can go in now. Ah, you swine. To be fair, it starts to hurt your fingers after a while doing this. That one goes to the back. Is it? That one? Well, that's right. That one there. Then the pin can go in. In the vice, because it's easier. Cool. That goes in there. Oh, he's tighter than the other ones. He is tight. that way is tight he's in ah they had him in then I thought he'd go in ah swine cool it's not as easy as they make out you know right that's that push him in Go, in you get. Come on. <clears throat> well. See that? It's just... Right. Nope. 
not want to go in. I'm sorry, Model City, but it's 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 hard work getting this to get that to go in is an absolute pain in the ass. I'm trying my best here to get it to go in, and it's just not having it. I've done that, done that. It's just in. Push him down. No, he's just pushing it out. Pushing it back out. Oh. It goes down. Oh, it's just enough. It's enough. Is that going in? Oh, it's just enough. That is. That's all right. Quick while we're here. Let's get the uh, that one out. Boom. Don't need that one in. This one here. 58. Push that one out. Come on. When you come out. There you go. So, it's the wrong way, isn't it? It's the right way. It's the right way. Ah, get in. Right. Push him around. And then this one here, the sport one. Ah, don't you pop out, you bugger. That's him. And we'll give him a bang to get him in. Good solid bang. And then this should go all the way around. Ah, come on. There you go. So that's the next one. Oh, and then finally, one more, I think. And then we're almost done. One more, one more. Uh, if I was doing this as a time lapse, I'll be just doing you one wheel and then crying at the other ones while I'm doing them. Right, and we do got 11 in the chat. Recommended age is 14, these ones. It says so on the box. It says 14 for these kits. <sighs> 14. Um, but they do say that they make good presents and then to be fair it has come up quite well it's just that elastic band took me a while to do these wheels anything with the elastic band and it's a bugger to do and now it falls apart <laughs> yeah it's not because let's not uh get too hasty now so that's the fat side there that's the fat side there so whoops wrong way around two fat sides and then they go in halfway Come on. Right. Come on. That's him. He's in tight. It actually starts to hurt your fingers after a while, pushing on this wood and all the sharpness of the wood. Just saying. Right, he's in as well. And then finally, last the rug and the band, but this time, make sure we get the right one. It's got to be 95, remember? Near as damn it. Right, is that one. And then up to there. Up to there. That's 95. There. Check out this time across there 95. Needs a bit of trimmed off there, I think. A little bit of a trim. That's him. Right. So, last piece to go in. I don't want to glue, I just want to try and get it on without glue. So, that's straight down there. The pin needs to go that side. The, 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 the premise of the elastic band and the wood pin is very, very clever, but it's just, it, it's a hell of a hard to get the pin in 
like so. Because you you know you've got to keep it about halfway up. See, I'm using a my um, my modelling little vice here, so that goes to the back. Right. So I'll go to the back halfway, get that pin touching as well, and try and push the rubber down at the same time as the pin. Come on. Ah, oh, no, in gone in. I thought I'd done it then, but no, one half didn't quite get in. So about there, that side up. Not quite in. He's not quite in there, is he? He's popped up there. That's the problem. He keeps popping up there. It's a nightmare. Absolute fucking nightmare. It looks. It is. It's. It's. It's weird. It's. It's all right. It's a very nice build. You know, we've got this far, and it's looking okay. But it's just these little added. You know, because they they don't want you to use glue. They don't want you to use um, metal or anything but it's just it's a little bit fiddly when you get to the, anything elastic because you've got like friction happening and he's not done he just he's pushing one down so i'm gonna use a bit of glue again on this one so a little tab of glue to try and keep it stuck together like so just so that it will go down at the same rate and then when you get to there it won't quite go down well there you go so he's in he's in both sides so now we can get these here get these out and get them in quick before they lose their so again that one at the back so we need to put him in there and he goes in so he's straight, he's straight, he can go in. Yeah, he's in. He's in. That's good. So now we pull this one down. Wait, I've got to get the sport out of this one, right? And then, so you've got that side there. And they go in, they go in. They go in. Squeeze them together. Come on, don't you dare push out. He's not quite gone in, has he? Which one is it? That one's in. He's not quite gone in. So push it, he's in now, and then give him a bang, and they kind of fit in. <laughs> so, and then they switch around there, switch Rooney. Oh, come on. Which is a clever idea for the elastic bands, and there you go, we're in. There you go, there it is. Boom. And I think that's everything from there. Now we've got to... Um, Put the wheels on, so you've got the smaller wheels for the front, obviously. They go in there, there's the first one. There's the second one. And you have these little pieces here, which you've got to pop out. Where's my little tool that I've worn? I've actually worn this one out, look, see? Um, push him out. Come on. It's fine. Go this way then. Great. He's coming out. So there's the first one. And he goes in which way? That way. That's him. He's quite a tight fit as well. Again, this one here. Expect the tight fit. There you go. Come on, here you come. He's done. Little wheel in. That way. 
Come on. In you get. Oh, he's tight. So he's one's in. Finally getting there. Just two more wheels to go. Brilliant. Put the big one in. Come on. He should be a bit tight. He's in. And then the little piece there goes on top. It says quite upright there. There you go. There you go. And the final one. Cool. These have been actually really fun to build. Beam. Give him a little twist. Come on, you twat. There you go. He's in. And finally, I think we are done. It's just that little bloody... Ugh. I don't know what to do about this. Is that there? This elastic band thing. I can't do nothing more about it. I've tried every way I can to get him to clip in that little slot. And I can he do it, unfortunately. Right. See what I mean? There he is there. He needs to go in there. But I can't. But anyway, it does still work. If we pull it back, it's got potential motion, so it does go forwards. Okay, there you go. And then let it go, and it does. It's still got all that and everything. It steers on the front, as you can see. There you go. It's got some steering there on on the on the um, on the model there. Okay. So these are Zoe um, Scale Model Magic. Who asked me, is it bolster wood? No, it's not bolster wood. It's actually laminated ply. Um, as you can see by the sprues, they're laminated ply. Good quality three ply, right? And what they do, which is brilliant, is laser cut them to, to the, what they need. They design them. If you look back to my last video I'd done on Tuesday... You would have seen that I've done the unboxing this and explained it all to to you how it's all built and everything. So, yeah, apart from a few little gaffes by me, it says three hours. I've done it in two hours and thirty minutes. I started at seven. I've done quite a lot here. It's a lot, lot of pieces. There it is. There's the final thing. It looks fantastic, doesn't it? Really, really pleased with it um yeah for a live build and i said that clutch system it got in here with those you can't really see it but they got like two little teeth that flick out so if you push it forwards nothing happens but if you go back those teeth kick in and you get professional motion it is fantastic comes with the box so you get your box and you can do that with it if i just Bring the camera forwards a bit and push him to whoops, don't want to lose that. Push him down a little bit. Come on. There's the camera there. Whoops, just got the wire there out of the way. Right, there you go. And it fits on this little box. And there it is. That's it. The only thing you've got to do with this one is take the magnet box off because there's four little magnets. Let's just put the glue on here because I don't want the glue getting everywhere. Put the glue on there. Cool. Right. It's got one, two, four little feet in the bottom there. And you can push the feet in that way. I bet they won't go in now, will they? There you go. Come on. Cough. Even these are tight. My fingers are starting to hurt now from pushing all that wood. 
Come on, one, two. Get in there. And one of it is, it's the feet that's destroyed me. It's ruined me. <laughs> Let's get the feet in. So the feet have gone in. Come on. One, two, three, and four. Let's put all this back in here because I know it's just for prosperity. Put that all back in there. Put that back in there. Put the tool. Actually, I better put the tool back inside proper. Uh, let me put the tool in there. All these little bits. So apart from where I've I bored up with the with with um the elastic band. It has gone together very, very nicely, very well on the base there. Fan bloody tastic. Really, really pleased. Really pleased. So there you go. That was an amazing little build. Um, if you go to the um link down below, there is, if I just scroll down, there is uh a Kickstarter page. Um I'll just uh, put that into the into the chat. There is the Kickstarter page for you. Oh, sorry, done that wrong. I find the Kickstarter page. There it is. Uh, I've made it a bitly link because it's just a long one to um, to have. Um, and what I'll do is, is I'll, I'll do it again. Um, right click, paste. And you'll be able to link into it. If you want to buy some of these models. I'll pin it to the top as well, pin message. So I'll pin it to the top. So if you want to... Um, if you want to, you can you can buy these kits. I think they're about forty euros. But if you um, if you go onto the website as well, there's lots of information on the other kits they do. They do some phenomenal kits, by the way, some really really good kits. Um, and I've been really really impressed with sorry tractor outside, another tractor outside. I've been really really impressed. It's it, they they do go together well. You know, there is some hard bits, but it's an engineering feat anyway to get this sort of stuff together anyway, isn't it? You know, it's very, very well thought out. The instructions look good. You know, I don't think we've got anything to worry about here putting these together. Let me just... Uh, da, 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 got them in there. Um, but yeah, it's been a lovely little build. I've enjoyed it. It's the two and a half hours I'm never going to get back anyway. <laughs> um, if you ever need a set of... Um, a set of things these are the best ones getting from amazon there's a link in my description this is what i use pixel ones so yeah i think we're pretty much done for this evening now thank you all for watching did you enjoy it if you did would you write a comment below that you enjoyed watching this and this was something a little bit different to uh what we normally do because normally plastic um but just look at it it's a phenomenally well-built car for a wooden model um I suggest you back them on Kickstarter. Um, as I said, got another few more to to build, and hopefully um, you'll go in and have a look and um, and and build and buy your own and build them. I think they're due out in December, um, and I'll do another one next Thursday as well if I've got time. And uh, there's not much else really to say about my channel. I do apologise for. Um, not doing a lot of building because my 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 own life's been a bit uh bit busy. There you go, another one there. That's the that's the buggy we're gonna do next week. My life's been a little bit busy and I really haven't had chance to really kick on and um do some building of my own here. I've still got that mozzie to build. Um I haven't finished that yet. Uh, the lightning's to be finished as well. I haven't done that yet either. So, yeah, I'm just really all over the place at the minute. Um, so, yeah, all's well that ends well. Anyway, there you go. I'll leave that there because I'll take some pictures of it in a minute. Thanks all for watching the live stream. If you liked it, can you click like? That'd be brilliant. 
if you can share it, that'd be even better. If you know somebody who likes modeling, share them to them as well and let them know that, you know, we, we are here trying to build models um, and uh, trying to help uh, build the community up. There's a Facebook page, as you know. Um, if you look in the description, there should be a Facebook page there. There's all sorts going on here at, uh, at Moz 651 on Models is Workbench. And I will get back to doing more live builds with the actual scale uh, scale electrics, the FX and the Tamiya soon. The reason I'm saying scale electrics is that I've actually just uh, received one, so <laughs> for the nephew to have a little play with. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks all again. Cheers.